this is Friday, July 2nd, 2021, and I'm going to remove the possibly toxic foam from this Philips Respironix CPAT machine. I have been overall happy with this CPAP machine. I do, however, tend to wake up with headaches. So that is why I am modifying it. So we need to be careful not to ruin our sensors. Thank you. 
It's not that much louder. Just a little bit more of the high-pitched, like, jet engine whine, but overall it's not that much louder. Alright, let's try with on. This is going to make virtually no difference to me at all. Plus, all the chemicals I've already breathed in. So, yay. There's just a hint of a turbine wine now that wasn't there before. Don't try this at home. I am not responsible for any way that you screw yourself up. I just have to do this because I really need to sleep. And I often wake up with headaches in the morning, so I don't know if that's from breathing foam chemicals or for some other reason, but if it wasn't for that, I'd give this machine high marks. It's, it's a great machine, it works well. I like that you can separate it out and just use without the humidifier. So if it wasn't for the foam, it'd be a great machine. But definitely, I'm not responsible for any of your medical concerns or issues whatsoever. This is literally just me taking my life into my own hands because I need to breathe while I'm sleeping. That's all there is to it. This is, this is, this is, this is me doing what it takes for me to survive. And if Philips wants to void my warranty, well, it's something I can live with.